Well, welcome to the beautiful Black Horse Lake on the Water's Edge Fishery uh, near Milton Keynes. And I'm here testing, well, I'm very excited to be testing, the new TriCast Trilogy long range feeder rods. Now, regular match fishing readers will know how much I love the Trilogy commercial range, the rods I use myself. I think they're absolutely fantastic. And when these came through, couldn't wait to get them out. I've got the 13 footer on here and I'm chucking 50 meters today. It's quite a strong wind, so it requires a bit of a punch, but as you can see, lovely soft action rod with plenty of backbone in it to punch, you know, big feeders out, as you would expect for bream fishing. I mean, look at that action for sort of bream work. Lovely tippy action. And we're having a good day. I mean, I don't know what this is. Oh yes, look at that. Nice fish. Oh, look at that. <laughs> nice skimmer. Just what this rod's designed for. So there's three rods, look at that, lovely fish. There's three rods in the range. There's the 12 foot, which is described as the medium. Look at that, lovely fish. A 12 foot medium, which is obviously fishing up to sort of 40 meters. It's a really nice soft bream fishing rod, but would be good for, you know, chucking meth feeders sort of 60 meters probably. You know, you, with a meth feeder, it's been a bit more aerodynamic, you get a bit more distance. The 13 foot, which is described as the long, which I'm using today. Um, again, probably 50, 60, 70 meters of a cage feeder. And then there's a 14 foot, which is described as the extreme model, and it's a real brute. It's, um, that is for, you know, chucking the extreme range, 70 meters plus with cage feeders and big rivers and stuff like that. I mean, I'm just fishing a, a window feeder today, just putting plenty of particles. It's the first time I've ever been to this venue, so I got tipped off about it. Cracking place, really, really nice, big gravel pit. Plenty of fish in here. We've only just started to catch a few skimmers though, so hopefully the sport's gonna, gonna pick up, but I'll just get this launched out. Just, just packing it full of worms, maggots. As you can see, it's a, it's a very, it's very soft action. As you can see there, I've got the, Got the feeder loaded up and all the bends right at the top. Which there's, you know, there's loads of power down this bottom end and the rod itself feels super light. I don't mean light as in the plane actually, I mean the actual rod is very light. It's, it's, it's unusual to have such a, a powerful rod that's so light. Let's just get this out there. Look at that, absolutely wax it out there. No problem, it's the clip right on the mark. Let's get that braid under. But yeah, it's... Um, I was a bit unsure at first because it's so soft and lightweight, but now I'm getting into it, really like putting it through its paces, whacking it into that headwind, and uh, yeah, it's a nice bit of kit. The 12 footer, I'd, I'd say, is, is, is probably the rod you use if you went to, going to Ireland and fishing like a numbers game for lots of smaller fish. You know, chucking 40 meters and you want something that's going to just keep doing it over and over again, it'd be absolutely brilliant for that. This one would be my bream rod for sure, this 13 footer, because you know, nice and versatile at 13 foot. With the heavier tips in, you could use it on, you know, bigger rivers and whatnot. And like I say, that 14 foot is an absolute brute for the days when you have to go. I don't like to do that, but for the days when you've got to go a hell of a long way. But yeah, they're a really nice range of rods. Lovely fixtures and fittings as you expect. The American guides on there that Tricash use that are, uh, you know, really, really hard wearing. Nice and big for your braid fishing. The typical push-in tips, they've got no colour on them, just a black tip. I really like that, it's classy looking. Nice understated graphics, big long handle, secure reel seat. They're not cheap, you know, they retail between 250 and 300 quid, so that, you know, they're a proper bit of kit. But as with anything that's tri you know it's going to be top quality. But um, really, really good rods and uh, I think you should definitely check them out.